You know, the Oklahoma Senate voted unanimously to suspend Senator Ralph Shorty from office. He can still come to the Capitol. In fact, he could vote here, but everything has to be in a limited capacity. His name is erased from his office, from the directory, and his parking space. This is a very serious issue before this House. The resolution speaks for itself. Senator Ralph Shorty wasn't there Wednesday as the Senate voted to suspend him from office. He may have lost his leadership positions as well as his office privileges, but Shorty still collects a $38,400 salary. I think that's really inexcusable. I wish my colleagues in the Senate had taken the full measure of punishment and said, no, Senator Shorty, you don't get to vote, nor do you get to take taxpayer dollars. And Lieutenant Governor Todd Lamb released this statement saying Ralph Shorty should resign from his seat so the good people of Southwest Oklahoma City can move forward with electing a new state senator. And just in the last few hours, there is a growing list of people calling for Senator Ralph Shorty's uh, resignation, removal from office. It includes Governor Mary Fallon, Oklahoma Senate, Republicans and Democrats, as well as uh, both political parties for our state. We're live at the Capitol tonight. Brett Pagansky, KOCO 5 News. Okay.